What type of whales are found in Canadian waters? The two groups are represented here. The Adontocetes, or toothed whales, and the Mysticetes, or baleen whales. The largest toothed whale is the sperm whale. Bachelor males regularly visit the St. Lawrence River. The females, as well as immature and older males, remain in the warmer waters. A sperm whale may reach lengths of 60 feet and weigh as much as 36 metric tons. Pilot whales live in large herds, sometimes composed of several hundred animals. Mass strandings are known to occur. They are still hunted in the Faroe Islands. The male can reach 30 feet in length and weigh four metric tons. As opposed to most cetaceans, its rather high dorsal fin is in the front half of the back. The beluga is similar to the pilot whale, except for the fact that it is completely white and lacks a dorsal fin. This species is usually associated with the cold waters along the ice flows in the vicinity of the North Pole. A small population of belugas are permanent residents of the St. Lawrence River. It could almost be considered as a relic of a once larger population found around the glacial fringes of the last glaciation period. Males can reach 15 feet and weigh almost one and a half metric ton. The harbor porpoise is not only the smallest cetacean, but the most inconspicuous as well. Its small size, a maximum length of six feet, and the low dorsum fin make it difficult to detect. A very still sea is needed in order to observe these whales. It often gets caught in fishing nets and drowns. It has been hunted locally for its meat. It is also known as the common porpoise. White-sided and white-beaked dolphins are very much alike. They live in large herds and are real acrobats, performing highly spectacular jumps as they travel. Males measure close to 10 feet and can weigh more than 440 pounds. The back of both these dolphins is characterized by a high dorsal fin. The second largest odontocete is the killer whale. Males are 30 feet long with eight metric tons of muscles and blubber. It is the most intelligent of all whales and lives in highly structured social units called pods. A female is the dominant figure in a group of killer whales. As top predators, killer whales will feed on a variety of prey items. These include the larger cetaceans, which they hunt in pods. Strangely enough, man is excluded from their menu. Mysticetes are divided into two groups. The right whales, characterized by the lack of throat grooves and their skimming feeding method, and the roracles, which have throat grooves and feed by gulping or swallowing prey items as they swim. The name roracle comes from two Norwegian words, roar, meaning groove in reference to the longitudinal pleats along the throat and belly and haval, which means whale. The mink whale, also called the sharp-nosed whale or piked whale, is the smallest and most common of the roracles. It measures 30 to 33 feet long and can weigh 10 metric tons. It is characterized by a tall and curved dorsal fin and in northern Atlantic specimens by a white band across the flippers. The two-level dorsal fin probably accounts for its name, humpback whale. Its scientific name, Megaptera, comes from Greek for large wings in reference to its typical elongated pectoral fins. They can reach 16 feet in length. Humpbacks are the whales that sing. Their songs have fascinated and intrigued anyone who has heard them. These whales sing only on their breeding grounds near the Dominican Republic or close to the Hawaiian Islands in the Northern Hemisphere. The size of the humpback whales vary between 40 and 50 feet and its weight from 25 to 30 metric tons. The fin whale is the second largest whale in the world. With its 60 to 72 feet in length and its 40 to 80 metric tons, this animal, which can swim at speeds of 30 kilometers an hour, has been spared by whalers up until the invention of harpoon cannons and steam-driven vessels. The fin whale is easily recognized. Its lower jaw is white on the right side. Its dorsal fin is relatively small and triangular in shape. It feeds on small crustaceans and small fish. It does not pull its tail out of the water as it dives. 
The blue whale is without a doubt the largest animal that has ever lived. A Russian ship has reported capturing a female that measured more than 100 feet in length and weighed close to 200 metric tons. The largest whale to be scientifically measured tipped the scale at 130 metric tons and reached 100 feet in length. 